Did you see how sticky that down flat down was? I stopped on the rail. Oh my this God. is a bigger, a bigger one. A bigger. Come on, Benton. I literally all I want to do is snowboard, and here we are. I will say that the gondolas out here, though, are teeny tiny. What's up Team Hawk House? Welcome to the most insane train park I think I just ever rode through my entire life. It's not even done. It's not even done. We got an insane three jump line here. There's, it's so flowy and it's so like hit after hit after hit. Like I wasn't ready for this. Killington, that's where we're at by the way. Killington Peace Park destroys all of the Peace Parks that I've been to. This is sick. I haven't been to Boreal yet, but let's go. Benton, I literally, all I want to do is snowboard. And here we are, waiting on Benton. This place is insane. We're literally standing on the takeoff of a jump, but there's nowhere to stand that's not a feature because this whole place is the sickest park I've ever been at. And uh, Benton's got to tighten his bindings. But there is one thing in my life I never have to wait on, and that's today's sticker <laughs> shout out. My Ninja 17K with the warmest merch in the game, rocking it. Looking good, dude. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. Looking fresh. As well as we got Mountain Leaf Dog Cloud is literally the name I see. Uh, with the gold sticker underneath the candy grind uh, sticker. Looking so sick. Guys, thank you so much for snagging the stickers. Buying merch supports the dream more than you guys know. It's how I can come to Killington. Whoa! I told you we're standing on a jump. It's how I can come to Killington to support the dream. So if you guys want to get an Evolution sticker or any of the merch, Hoodies, t-shirts, long sleeves, they're all linked in the description if you do snag any of them. Tag me on Instagram and I'll give you guys gear and sticker shout outs. But if you're not following my Instagram, you're missing out on so much bonus extra content as well as it's how you know we're riding on the 
where we're riding on the week on the east as well as where I'm riding daily. So you know I'd be at Killington and if you're at Killington, you can come say what up to me if you're following my Instagram. So follow the Instagram. All right, that's always a mouthful. I appreciate you guys for sticking through that. If you did, subscribe. And now Benton is finally ready. Just, just so you guys know, as much as you had to suffer through that plug, I had to suffer through Benton tightening his ear. Let's send it. Are you ready? Yeah. You sure? I'm ready. You, you sure you don't want to tighten like your boots, your, you know your what? goggles? I should, I should take this. You yeah, tighten your do. pants. <laughs>
we have two more hours left in the day. We literally, it flew by. So I think we're gonna go look at these other parks. It'd be really sick. We're about to get tunnel vision, guys. Oh, you're so tall. I don't even think I could do that. Oh, I got it. You got it? <laughs> I, I, I gotta like get on my tippy toes. If I'm not on my toe side edge, I can't get it. Now that we're at Killington, I'm a little sad that we only have one day here. I definitely think we could have done two. One for like riding the mountain and then one like today that we commit to straight park riding because deep down we're park rats. We love the park. That's all we want to ride. But then this place looks huge runs everywhere so we just rolled up into like this center village is massive they've got a gondola i didn't know they had a gondola this is crazy that's the smallest gondola ever thanks benton heading up this uh gondola took us to a whole new world everything's just caked in snow look how different these trees are park and we're definitely lost we have no idea where it's at but the snow is amazing Whoa! we didn't miss it we found it we found it benton the stash i think this is where the stash has originated the stash i'm not gonna lie it's a little scary all the features being logged especially out here on the east coast because like a lot of them had ice on them and stuff it, it was still kind of sick i'm not gonna lie i've seen so many clips and videos and stuff out of that park so it was finally really cool to finally go through it and right, there's still a woodward park somewhere we gotta find Did you see how sticky that down flat down was? I stopped on the rail. These are big boy jumps. I'm not hitting these. See, this is why I keep benting around because like these jumps are big. At the end of the day, I'm tired. I'm not gonna go huck myself on these jumps, but Benton doesn't care at all. All right, Benton. He's going gorilla mode. You ready? I'm ready, you ready? Oh this God. is a bigger a bigger one a bigger jump benton do you got it he was not kidding that kid yesterday said they were doubleable jumps and i was like yeah i don't think so these are bigger than colorado's <laughs> jumps Damn, this bad. thing is huge Uh, I'm, say, I'm standing here so, or I'm sitting here, I'm not staying anywhere. Sitting here so confused, I had no clue the East Coast made jumps that big. At all. That's way bigger than they, what they had at Corinthia. Well, I guess they have the two supers at Corinthia, but those, I mean, that was a, 50, a heavy there's a 50 in there. I'm really sad that um, the rails were so sticky though. Yeah. <laughs> I like stopped on that down, flat down. But Benton, wait a second. There's another gondola. This place is massive. I didn't even know there was another gondola. How do we go home? I'm cold. <laughs> I'm definitely happy we kind of explored a little bit. I will say that the gondolas out here though are teeny tiny. We did 
did it. We found the lodge that we started the day at. I never thought we were gonna find it. It's crazy how quickly we were all like, oh, I'm so tired. But we're gonna go to Dark Side Board Shop and, and do a hike session after we like, we wanna find like a sit down restaurant to eat at. We're kinda sick of eating fast food. Let's try and eat some better food for us. Relax for like an hour. And then we're gonna have a heavy hiking. That park looks insane. Like a uh, session. So, whoo, this is a sick day. You have fun? Dude, I think this is the funnest resort I've ever been to. This is period. <laughs> Whatever we're doing. That was insane. Peace Park, by far the best Peace Park, Peace Park we've ridden. The overall the, mountain is incredible. Yeah, this is this is really cool. If you're on the East Coast and you haven't come to Killington yet, like, what are you doing? Why are you even complaining? Yeah, they, there's no reason to. Yeah. This is better than Colorado. When when we come to the East Coast, all I'm realizing is a lot of you guys are complaining for no reason. You guys, why do you even come to Colorado? Dude. Come to Killington. This place was fire. Also, this is not an ad. Killington did not pay me to say that. All right, so we got to go and get the pin for Killington. And I also got to get Bobby and Roman a souvenir. So we're going to sneak into their gift shop. I always like to get Bobby a t-shirt from the coolest place I go to on a snowboard trip. And obviously Killington. I mean, I don't think it's obviously going to be the best. I'm pretty sure it's going to be the best park and everything. So I'm going to get like a Woodward shirt from Killington. And so then when she wears it, people are like, no way, like you rip. And then she's like, because <laughs> she doesn't snowboard. So Greg has a fancy snowboard, so he's going to board lock it up. You should always lock your snowboard up if you're by the end of the day parking lot. This is like a good theft time. Or you can do what Benton does and just beat the crap out of your snowboard and then no one wants it. If you don't have a board lock though, I got all my gear, my board lock, all my stuff guys is in the description. Here you go, Greg. Thanks for locking mine Thank up you. too. Dude, I gotta get Roman this. A snow cat toy, what? Are you kidding me? All right, so I got Bobby's thing, but I more importantly got my pin for Killington. I was a little sad, I'm not gonna lie, because the employees had a, a Woodward Killington pin and I really wanted that and I asked them and they said no. I was like, I'll pay you 30 bucks for it and they're like, no. So if you work here and you have that Woodward uh, Peace Park uh, pin, I'll pay you 30 bucks for it. But overall, I'm still stoked I got a pin. I get a pin at every single ski resort that I ride. So if you like collecting pins or you want to do that the same ones you do or if you just want one i have a evolution pin right here definitely snag it it's super sick and it supports the dream but i definitely hope you guys are enjoying this week on the east as much as i am and if you are make sure you smash that like button it really does support the channel because more people will see the videos if you guys smash the like button the almighty youtube algorithm then blesses this video and more people can see it so that's awesome and then if you're new to the channel of course hit that subscribe button there are like 80% of the people that watch each video aren't subscribed to the channel. So we need more subscribers to be one watching the videos, turn the notifications on, but hit that subscribe button. The last person we gotta say a big shout out to, we got him in a couple shots, but we got Greg. Greg is the master planner. Well, we planned it together, but Greg's a huge reason why we came out for this week and it's been insane. So shout out to Greg. And Greg volunteered his truck for the driving and everything, which saves so much money not having to get a rental. And last, like, the whole Washington trip kind of got soured because I got a bad rental. Benton's not very nice to Greg's truck, so thank you, Greg. <laughs> but with that, Timo guys, thank you so much for shredding with us today. And as always, thanks for watching. Keep evolving. We'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. We're going to Whiteface. I hear that's pretty good too. I'm on top of the ocean, living like life ain't frozen, feeling my feet been chosen for something other than motion, yeah. Mama told me I'ma be somebody. I ain't never gonna need nobody, no, no. That's what it's like working for me.